my name is Chris Braun from Braun Manufacturing. Today we're going to show you our 48 inch aluminum sluice box and our 34 inch sluice box. Um, this is not a mining instructional video. This is a how to set up your sluice box and run it correctly. Uh, what we've got here is a 48 inch sluice with the header. Uh, it's fully convertible. Turn this sluice into high bankers, dredges. Uh, it's just bolt on kits. You just unbolt these attachments and bolt on the new one, so it's a very versatile machine. Uh, once you buy this one, you're on your way to any type of mining that you'd like to do. Uh, with this loose box here, it's built on the water pressure drop. So what it does is it funnels your water in, it pinches it off, and then it drops the water pressure. Gold is 18 times heavier than water. Anytime you have a water pressure drop, the gold falls out. Basically, we built mining equipment to do the same thing. Uh, anywhere where your pay streaks are, where you find gold is a water pressure drop zone. So, uh, what we're going to do is set this up for you and uh, show you how it should run so you can mimic it when you get yours. So we found some fast water here. It does take a lot of water to run this loose. Uh, you need pretty fast water. It's not like the old square straight boxes. Uh, this is new technology, so uh, twice the material, twice the fun. Let's get it set here. What I'm going to do get this thing running in a full head, small drop right there, and you can see, you can feel the water pressure. It's real fast here, and it's a lot lighter down here. That just means your gold's going to drop. Uh, it's the same thing with our 34 sluice box, just on a smaller version. Backpacking, uh, that converts into a mini high banker, and this does the large, or smaller dredge, larger dredge. <coughs> Let me grab some material and I'll show you how it should run. Normally in a mining situation, we'd be dumping five gallon buckets into this, uh, but for the video, we're just gonna show you how it, how it should work here. You just dump your material in. already done. All your heavies sitting in there. You want to see the top of your ripple. That thing should be clean within a few seconds. That's all there is to it. Now this sluice box is designed to do a lot of material. You don't have to clean this thing up every hour, every two. You can set it up and let it run all day. As long as your ripples are not packed and you're running clean, just keep pouring the material through it. More material means more gold. I'm going to show you how to get this out of the water now for your cleanup. What you want to do is you want to pick it up kind of evenly, slow the water down as you come up and pull it out. You don't want to dislodge any gold and send it, send it down. Slow your water, let your water come back, and out you go. Good. Now at this point, what you do is you take it over to a, let's say a large bucket or a tub, unbolt these two bolts right here, clean off your screen, pull your carpet out, flip your carpet upside down, bounce it out, clean it out like you would any other type of mining equipment wash the whole thing out, and that's all there is to it. Put it back together and use it another day.